out here, what, three days now? The energy here is electric, it's filled with love, it's filled with anger, it's filled with community, and it's centered on education. We're here to demand four things from our administration. Number one, to call for a permanent and immediate ceasefire in Gaza. Number two, to disclose all financial investments in Zionist entities or organizations. Number three, to divest from said entities. And number four, to drop all student disciplinary hearing charges against our organizers. And this is not just Emerson students, this is people from across the community. We have unhoused individuals. Uh, we have just local citizens. We have people from outside organizations. We have people from other schools. We have so many Jewish community members. I have not heard one utterance of anti-Semitic hate speech. That's just not what we do. I am here for Palestinian liberation and the liberation of all peoples worldwide. That's why I'm here. That's why we're all here. Palestine will be free. Palestine will be free. From the sea to the river. From the sea to the river. Yesterday was extremely difficult for me. Just the emotional wear and tear of being in this one place for three days straight without going home, without sleeping in a real bed. But every time I start to feel uncomfortable or just try to complain, I remember the children that are being slaughtered. And anything that I've been through, anything that I will ever go through in my life, God forbid, will never come close to the horrors going on right now in Gaza. I can't get this imagery out of my head. We're the first generation who's grown up with war and genocide at our fingertips our entire lives. And I think that's what you're seeing right now. We will not stop. We will not leave this place until our demands are met. We are dragged out of here by the Boston Police Department. Ceasefire now! Ceasefire now! Ceasefire now!